what is up you guys i am back with another video so in today's video um it's a very exciting video even for me daisy may had her puppies and you are not gonna want to miss this video because these puppies are cute beautiful and they're just amazing and a blessing y'all will not want to miss out on this lovely beautiful video so before y'all come at me um i recorded her the first time when she was six weeks pregnant yes she carried her babies full term the video is going to be scattered here and there um and the babies are healthy before we begin this video if you're new to this channel make sure you like subscribe and hit the bell button that'll mean a lot um so you could get notified on a new video i upload especially about daisy May and her puppies so y'all don't want to miss that if y'all love puppies i'm telling you puppies 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 so stay tuned i could also record as they get older so y'all can see more updates about them like i said stay tuned and subscribe guys you don't want to miss this so subscribe to this channel another thing a long story short after she gave birth she was starting to panting am i saying it right she was panting and each day was getting worse and worse so anyways back what i was saying um she kept panting a lot and just being restless and uncomfortable so i looked it up and it said that she could be low on calcium or a placenta could have still been inside of her and that's making her sick which that could give her issues so anyways i took her to the hospital because i wanted to get that checked i didn't want nothing bad to happen to her because she is my baby i stay on top of her stuff like if something's wrong with her i take her to the vet because i want her to be as healthy as she can be so i took her to the hospital and the doctor did tell me that she is very low on her calcium they had to put her on over some medicine for her calcium could go up she is anemic um i think that has to do with her losing a lot of blood during her giving birth her red blood cells were normal which means she didn't have any infection going on which well, just her white blood cells now she's doing better she isn't panting as much she's panting but not as much as she was the vet was like what are you feeding her and i'm like well i'm feeding her the expensive food and it's adult food and he was like you're gonna have to change that to puppy food because that is another thing why she's not getting what she needs especially feeding the puppies so i said oh, okay i had to stop at petco i had to buy her the stuff she needed and he told me to wing the puppies off of her milk because that's another issue why she's not getting the stuff she needs because they said it was going to like her bones and stuff which i caught it on time they said i really did caught it on time and i was happy because angelica was also telling me that i need to take her in i didn't know they were open on the weekends um so anyways i took her today on a saturday and yeah i got that all situated i bought her i bought her everything she needed at petco and i had to buy baby's bottles everything is so expensive like everything's gone up just a bottle itself is like for something i bought two of them and it was like nine dollars in total i think those are expensive for little bottles which i'm gonna show y'all see i bought these and they are expensive for little bottles the doctor also gave me um two of them that's why i bought two because i think he ran out or something i don't know what happened but he only gave me two of them and then he also gave me like a big old bottle with i kind of have to train the puppies how to drink a bottle um i tried doing it and they weren't attaching to the bottles and they really can't drink her milk anymore because it'll make her sick again so wish me luck to feed them with the bottles guys so let me get back to the video let me stop talking Easy me miss daisy may so daisy is currently like six weeks pregnant come here come show them come show them the babies so she's not my little girl anymore she's a mommy right mama i love you come on nigga show them your belly let's lay down okay so guys she is humongous like she's really really big her stomach is like humongous and I didn't think she'll have a big old belly but she does 
All right. Sorry guys, my camera's like, haven't been focusing lately. So if it comes out blurry, I'm sorry. But yeah, that's Daisy May, and I will keep y'all updated later on. Guys, this is gonna be my breakfast. This is the only thing I'm gonna eat all morning. But I don't mind, because it fills me up. I don't know about y'all, but grapes fill me up sometimes. Or, not sometimes, all the time when I eat them. But yeah. Okay guys, she's been doing this all night. I could not sleep at all. But I think she's ready to give birth to him. I don't know if it'll be tonight, tomorrow, the next day. But she's ready, she's been doing this. She's been going all over the bed, just trying to get comfortable. Just kept waking me up like 30 minutes to an hour. I am so exhausted. But yeah, let's see what happens. And yeah, let's see what happens. Can y'all just tell I have like no, not much sleep. I look crazy. My eyes are burning right now. But yeah, she keeps panting. Y'all see that, guys? And then my bed looks a mess, but I got her a little bed. After she gives birth, all the babies are gonna lay right here. And then this blanket too will keep them warm. I have her little cooling pad here because I originally have it on her bed over there, but it's a mess. That's our personal fan. But this is what I did. It's all a setup. It's a mess, but this is what it's gonna make her comfortable and I want her to get used to this bed and this blanket. But yeah, this is her all night. Yeah, she kept waking me up. She will scratch me to go under the blankets and everything, but I'm just hoping she has, gives birth when I'm home after work. Or the next day because I do want to be here I do not really want to leave work at all but I will not have any choice that gives birth so hopefully everything hopefully she could hold them until I come home or tomorrow but I know she's ready because they say they pant a lot and they start like nesting and stuff so those are two signs she already has Hey guys, she just had two babies. She's relaxing right now. Look how cute they are. I have them under a heating pad so they could stay warm. Okay. She is pushing right now, so I think she's about to have a baby. Oh my god, I thought, I thought her foot was a baby. I was freaking out. Guys, her third baby was born. This is him. He is a boy, so she has two boys so far and one girl. She is an eater. She eats too much and she eats a lot. She's been eating the whole time since she came out. But these are my little babies. They're so little. And they're fighting over milk right now. <laughs> Mama so tired, oh, poor baby. So she didn't go to sleep last night and she didn't let me sleep as well. So she's actually napping right now. Um, I believe she still has more in her belly because this part's really hard. Oh, don't mind, one of them pooped on me. I can't leave her side, so like, you know, my mom, my hands are all dirty, but I think she has a few more puppies left. She was just born, my little baby. She's a girl. 
What is she doing? This is the one that likes to eat a lot. What is she doing? You're doing a good job, Mama. Yes, you are. Oh. Finally, all the babies are eating. You're so cute. Hey, Mama, are you sleepy too? Are you sleepy, Mama? I love you. You good. You did good, Mama. Good girl. So you guys, I feel like I'm gonna be staying up. Okay, she's gonna clean them. No, I just can't. Look at these two cuddling. Look at babies, Mama. The baby. You're so cute. <laughs> this little one likes to go under her. They're laying in the heating pad because they do get cold, so you have to leave them under a heating pad. Um, all these already got done eating, and then she's the only one left, so she might be done. Because look, she's asleep right now. Yeah, she's asleep right now, and her little belly's full. So I'm gonna grab her and put her under here so she can do with her brothers and sisters. And then mama's doing so good, right mama? You're doing a good job. <laughs> yes you are. So she's been eating and drinking, which is really good because she wasn't eating at first. So she ate most of all her food. And I know she's hot, but I just don't want to put the fan. Make the baby's cold. But she's still sleepy with her. She's exhausted. Right, Mama? My poor baby. So, I never showed you how I set up her area. I bought a dog pool. Um, I have it like this because it kind of like closes it in. But I got her little mini dog pool. I bought the the pillow I showed you in the beginning. I put it underneath with this blanket, I tucked it all underneath, and then the heating pad with all the babies underneath them. They're relaxing. She is a wiggle worm. She will move everywhere when I try to put her with all her siblings, but she ends up moving everywhere. And then the rest of them. They are all have full bellies, that's all that matters. So I'm gonna let them lay under the heating pad. Guys, I am just obsessed with their little paws. Mama. This one is the girl, baby. Sorry guys, my camera's not focusing. This is her, come on mama. I'm just so obsessed with their little paws. Look how cute, oh my goodness. Trying to find her mama. I just wanted to show y'all real quick before I put her with her mama. You were just, and she's the wiggle worm. She loves to be moving around and stuff. But yeah. <laughs> See, she moves so much. Let's show your face. Let's show your face. Oh God! Oh God! Okay, let me give it to her mama. Okay, guys, I want to show y'all how she cuddles with the babies. This is what she does, and she knocks out 
she knocks out when she's with them um they're so cute they like to cuddle with their mama the other ones i don't know where they went but they're probably underneath the heating pad being warm but there's two over there he's the smallest one right there you see they always wander all around like they're always moving one place or another I put them nice and comfy under the, you know, heating pad, and they always find a way to get out. Tell me, guys, is this the cutest thing ever? I got these for her because, long story short, I took her to the hospital because um, she was losing a lot of um, calcium. So, yeah, I bought her these because she did a good job. Um, and no worry, guys, I got it right on time, so she's doing a lot better. Um... But yeah, now she's finally sleeping. Look, look how cute. She just wraps her hand around them. That's so cute. Let me put this little guy with him. He's by himself. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I just wanted to move you. I don't want him by himself. But, oh my little babies. I'm just gonna keep y'all all. That's it. I'm just keeping y'all. But yeah, you guys. So stay tuned, you guys, because y'all do not want to miss these little babies. I'm going to try to post them as much as I can. The process while they're growing.